week. We're starting September 1st. More headaches at the DMV, and not just from the long lines, but now over rising costs. Drivers will be paying 25% more. Licenses and registration fees and more all going up. News 12's Robert Wolf tells us it's not just drivers now fighting, bowing to fight these hikes. Well, I think the fees are kind of excessive as they are right now. That was the feeling of many here waiting online at the Department of Motor Vehicles office in Brewster Friday. But come September 1st, you're going to be shelling out more of the green in order to legally drive in the state of New York. Last May, the state legislature adopted the 2009-2010 budget, and in doing so, raised license and registration fees 25 percent across the state. I don't like any more increased fees or plate fees, charges, and things like that. I don't like that at all. The DMV fees were raised to help plug a hole in the Metropolitan Transportation Authority's budget. The cost of renewing an eight-year Class D license, the one most drivers carry, will increase from $50 to $64.50. In the 12-county MTA service area, a one-time surcharge will add $16, bringing the cost to $80.50. State Senator Vincent Libel says he's furious it's being done on the backs of drivers. For folks who live in suburban and rural areas, this is a killer tax. Libel and other state and local leaders came to the DMV and Brewster to say enough is enough. The New York State Legislature and this hopeless governor uh, who are addicted to an unsustainable level of spending are now stealing out of the pocketbooks of people waiting in line in this DMV and throughout the state. Some in state government argue that the new DMV fees are needed to balance an ailing state budget, but people here say those new fees are just unfair. Reporting from Brewster, Robert Wolf, News 12.